everybody, welcome back to Wrestling Rampage. I'm Joe, and today, guys, I got something special for you guys. Now, if you guys have me on Facebook, um, I posted a picture of something I found at a Dollar General. And uh, it's pretty badass. And so I, uh, I decided that I'm going to make a quick unboxing on this and maybe even play it for you guys in a small review. So, this is what I found, guys. You won't believe this shit. It is... WWE WrestleMania Steel Cage Challenge. Um, there's the Macho Man Randy Savage, The Undertaker, uh, Bret Hart, Razor Ramon. There's Ted DiBiase, uh, Roddy Piper, and um, The Ultimate Warrior. It's an arcade kind of game, guys. Uh, ages 5 and up. WrestleMania Steel Cage Challenge. There's... There's Hulk Hogan. No, no, I didn't Hulk Hogan. That's Ultimate War. Excuse me. Uh, there's some gameplay footage of it. There's the uh, Jake the Snake Roberts. Let's go ahead and get this side. There's Bret Hart. Yeah, let's see if I can get a better shot. There we go. Um, this is a plug-and-play TV game. So, that's badass. Um, right here it says, uh, there, there's the Macho Man and Rowdy Piper. Uh, welcome back. Oh, and, and the top, I forgot to show the top. This is Steel Cage Challenge 25th Anniversary. Now, I actually own this game on the, on the original Nintendo, on the original NES. But, I picked this up, because uh, why not? <laughs> Welcome back. 25 years after its debut, the classic game is back in your hands except the toughest challenge of all, the WWE WrestleMania Steel Cage Challenge. Feel the pulse-pounding action in the singles and tag team matches that feature 10 incredible WWE superstars. You control every action-packed move and maneuver. What a maneuver, as Vince calls it. Uh, clotheslines, elbow drops, body slams, drop kicks, fly, uh, turnbuckle smashes, and flying clotheslines. When you're ready for the ultimate challenge, the steel cage is ready for you. And we got Ultimate Warrior, Brett the Hitman Hart, The Undertaker, Erwin R. Scheister, IRS, uh, Jake the Snake Roberts, The Million Dollar Man, Sid Justice, uh, Razor Ramon, Rowdy Roddy Piper, and The Macho Man, Randy Savage, WWE. Uh, action so intense only 15 foot of steel can contain it. Go for the WWE Tag Team Championships with the canvas shredding action. And tournament play will you be the next WWE Champion. So we're going to go ahead and unbox this for you guys so we can show you what I got. Oh, and by the way, I found I found this at at one of our local Dollar Generals. I was just in there, uh, Tommy and Pops wanted to stop in there and grab something, and I seen this on the shelf, and I go, fuck it, I'm buying this. Uh, I already ripped the sticker off, but I only got this for 20 bucks. So, um, it takes batteries. Uh, it takes three AAA ba uh, sorry, three AA batteries. So, um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to unbox this, and I'm going to show you guys, I'll give you guys a little review, play it. Um... And I'm gonna put it in the back in the back in the box as a collector's item because I like to keep things like this. So let's go ahead and open this up. I already cut the tape, so I don't have to mess with it too much. Let's go ahead and open it up. Boom. Okay, we gotta pull this out. All right. Let's go ahead and unravel this. Because I'm not sure if any of uh, if any of you guys actually played any plug-in plays before, but uh, some of them are actually pretty fun. I know we have a uh, we have a Price is Right one that we play sometimes, and it's pretty fun with Drew Carey on it, which is kind of fun. It, I mean, it really is. So I figured, why not get this? <laughs> Okay, let's get this other side, and then I'll show you what it actually looks like. Now, 
you know what, I'll be right back. Go ahead and get this out. Alright, we're back finally unboxing it. Sorry, I had, to, I had to use two hands and it was kind of a, 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 a struggle. But there we go. Here's what it looks like on the front. Here's the side. Here's the other side. 25th anniversary, baby. And then there's the front of it. Uh, this is where you uh, put your batteries in. Uh, with the screwdriver and here's what the top looks like it says WWF WrestleMania uh, steel cage challenge um, looks like your arcade kind of style up down left right you got the start button you got the on and off switch and then you got the A button and the B button so nothing pretty exciting about it and then right here is uh, where you plug it up uh, there's only two ports it's the uh, AVI cable and it's the uh, the audio and the video only so you just plug it up and you play it that, that's how simple this this thing is so let's go ahead and give it a shot alright guys here we are we're gonna be playing WWE WrestleMania Steel Cage Challenge uh, the plug and play so here we go guys let's give it a shot press start we got one-on-one -on -one, tag team uh, tag team championship and WWE championship now of course they had to change the WWF logo so I understand that we'll do one-on-one -on -one. okay we got easy and we got medium oh and difficult I guess we'll go medium we got a uh, regular match or steel cage. Just for a tryout, we'll do regular match. The controller's kind of easy to handle. Of course, there's only two buttons, and then you got the joystick. The joystick. Okay, we got Ultimate Warrior. We got The Undertaker. Jake Roberts. Ted DiBiase. Randy Savage. Bret Hart. Sid Justice. Rowdy Roddy Piper, Erin R. Scheister, Razor Ramon, and that's it. Uh, I think on the Master System they had a they had a, they had Hulk Hogan, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see who I want to be. I'll be I'll be Roddy Piper. It looks like we're gonna face Ted DiBiase. So. That'd be interesting. You got the A and B button, and you got the stick. From Glasgow, Scotland, weighing in 234 pounds, Rowdy, Ronnie Piper by the classic Howard Finkel, and his opponent weighing in 260, 216, 60 pounds, the Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase. Let's go ahead. I'm in the blue, Ted's in the black. There we go. Get the shit out of him. Ugh! This is this is actually not not bad not a bad plug and play controller. I'll be honest with you, it's pretty easy to uh, justify. Ooh. And I missed the elbow. Shit. Uh oh, Ted's coming back on me. Oh, body slam. Oh, he's covering me. One. Two. Oh, are you serious? I lost a fucking ten. Are you serious? Well, anyway. Look, looks like I need some fucking practice. But you see the you see the gist of it. Maybe I should have put it on easy. I don't know. <laughs> but here is your winner, the million dollar man, Ted DiBiase. Press A to continue. So... Pretty much, uh, yeah, that's what this is about, guys. I uh, hope that you guys enjoyed it. It's it's a pretty cool uh, little concept. I just need to get the hang of it. Uh, I, I have played this on the NES, 
and uh, I like it. Uh, overall, I think this is a pretty good presentation of this uh, for it to be 25 years later that it came out. So that's pretty badass, guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed this little preview for it. Uh, the controller is pretty cool. It's a joystick with the two buttons, like so. Shows you that it's on with the red light. Uh, it fits in your hand pretty well. You know, you just pretty much go like this. Um, I like it, guys. I'm glad. I'm glad I got it. So uh, there you guys go. If you guys enjoyed this review unboxing give it a thumbs up don't forget to share this all over social media like us on facebook facebook.com slash russell rampage 2 follow us on twitter at russell rampage don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more great videos coming each and every week right here for one of the best damn wrestling youtube channels go today wrestling rampage we'll see you guys next time